When I was younger, my dad would say to me, find a man who will love God more than he will ever love you. I remember as a kid being offended by this because I wanted a man who would love me and make me first in his life. How could he do that if he loved God more than he loved me? Like every young Christian girl growing up, I wanted to be the next girl who converts the bad boy. The guys I started to pursue were not God-loving men. And after a while, I'd be left heartbroken, lonely, questioning, will I ever find the one? But I realized something, that I hadn't made God number one in my life. I was more preoccupied with finding the one, finding the guy who'd bring me all the joy and happiness I desired. I was ignoring the only man who could fulfill the desires of my heart, God. And once I realized that I needed to center my life around Christ, the man God was calling me to be with came almost instantaneously. On a white horse, with the sun setting. Okay, totally wrong. I needed to be okay with being single. I needed to recognize that so much fruit and grace comes from that season of singleness. I could not allow myself to become discouraged in the lack of men. I needed to stop comparing myself to other girls who were in holy relationships. I needed to stop feeding myself with the lies that either all holy men are already in relationships or they were discerning the priesthood. Because when I did all this, I was closer to allowing myself to settle for less than what I deserve. We can be proactive. We can pray for our future spouse. We can be sisters to our brothers in Christ. We can encourage our fellow sisters in Christ and foster authentic relationships with them. We can grow in virtue on this journey to heaven. We are the crown jewels of creation. And because of that, we must never settle for anything less than a man who recognizes that we are fierce daughters of a king. A man who upholds everything that a woman is, desires nothing more than our good. A man who sets his standards to that of Christ, not of the world. That man will be able to love us more deeply than any boy who does not live for God. So ladies, be the woman God is calling you to be, so that you can love more deeply, so that you can uphold and love men with the same love they deserve. Find a man who loves God more than he'll ever love you.